any makeup. The only thing that I did was my eyebrows and they look all fleek. <laughs> do we even like, do we still say that? On fleek. <laughs> guys so today we're doing something fun and crazy at the same time and I just thought that it was so important to bring you guys along because I am all about body positivity and just being you know mentally healthy and just everything positive so I know that there's a lot of things on social media that make it seem unreachable whether it's you know places you travel or bodies or whatever the case may be sometimes we tend to feel like that's something i can't accomplish and it's all because social media tends to be a little fake and i'm just so glad though that there's you know content creators that are you know coming out and they're showing you the photo that they deleted versus the photo they actually posted so that you can feel like you know we're all human and while we enjoy that content and we consume it a lot it's just important to remember that not all of it is as you see it okay so I love being real with you guys um, if you guys see all the other videos that I have on YouTube I try to be you know as real as I can and just the Maria that I can be on camera and so today I wanted to bring you guys along this is my very first time doing it but I think because I am part of this entertainment industry that sometimes I have to do things to just make things easier on me okay so I am gonna go get my lips filled up and done and this is just to create symmetry because I tend to take a lot of photos and sometimes it's not even on social media. It's also just like about jobs that I get, you know, as a dancer, you know, sometimes as a model and it just takes me way more time to get ready and just prep my lips because they have that strange crookedness to it. I can't really see it on video. I can totally see it on a photo, so I'm just going to quickly show you guys what I'm talking about. And yeah, so I don't really think that it's such a big deal to do stuff like this. You know, I wasn't born with tattoos, but I just, I enjoy them so much. I obviously wasn't born with like these long nails, like they're obviously fake you guys. And you know, even my hair color, like I'm, I was not blonde. I am a natural you know brunette <laughs> so for me this it's gonna it's just gonna help me just get ready quicker and just feel a lot more confident when i'm doing like a job because i'm not constantly worried about how to smile like make sure that this side is bigger than the other like <laughs> you know it's just gonna make me have more time to be creative and not worry about those little things and um yeah you guys it's your body too so let's go Okay, so I'm at the place. What they're gonna do now is they're gonna put some numbing cream on my lips and then we're gonna get started. Hopefully I can record while I'm doing it. We'll see. They can't fit me. I couldn't do much recording in the location and I completely understand um, but so I just wanted to get home to show you the results as well as just talk to you guys about what I learned so that we can just make this an educational video my lips are swollen right now they're supposed to go down by like 30% and you're gonna see some red spots obviously because that's where she you know made the insertion um, but yeah are you guys ready They look so cute. Okay, wait, I'm gonna... Look at them. She did such a good job. All right, so I had so many questions for her. 
um, and I learned so much. So she explained to me what dermal fillers are, derma fillers are. I just wanted to know like what was in them. And she was very clear that dermal fillers have natural substances. Some may be synthetic. So the ones that she was using on me contained a substance called hyaluronic acid. And this is something that your skin naturally already produces. And what she's doing is just adding more by injecting it. So this substance is supposed to give you that hydration, that volume. And that's why you see my lips wait. So hydrated. Okay. Um, second thing is derma fillers are expensive. So make sure that you're not using a cheap version because that's usually when the incorrect substances are placed and then thirdly make sure that you are going to a place where you know you're gonna be in the right hands okay and i'm sorry like it's so hard to talk i still have like some numbness so yeah just don't be afraid to like ask about their training and like their certification like you just want to make sure that you are in the right hands they did have to inject me like right here with like the numb i forgot what it's called um you you would usually get it like if you go to the dentist to make all of this numb because my lips were so tiny <laughs> and um she yeah she just wanted to help me that was a little painful that's why you could probably you will see it in the video i'm like such a baby <laughs> but overall i'm super happy i can't wait to see them in like a more natural state and yeah totally recommend